What is up everyone, welcome back to another video of the Albanian Madridista and today I will be making my score prediction on Real Madrid versus Getafe. Now, last match we won 1-0 against Celta Vigo. I did predict a 3-1 win. Uh, I got I knew we were going to win, but I didn't, you know, predict the exact score. But um yeah, hopefully I can get it right this time. And yeah, we will play tomorrow at the Bernabal. This will be our first game at home this season. Um finally Finally, a burnabout game after you know having so many away games, like having the first three La Liga games away, and you know having so many you know away preseason games, like traveling and stuff. But yeah, we will make our first burnabout game this season. Um, we will be playing against Getafe, and now uh, Real Madrid. Yep, we have won all of our games so far. Yep, top of the table. Well, Getafe, they are sitting on 11th place. Um, I think that this is going to be a close game. I think we're going to win 2-1. The reason why is that um, when we usually play against Getafe, it's usually you know, pretty slow football. Um, again, you know, we sometimes struggle to score a lot against Getafe, but I know we're going to win for sure. I mean, the last time we played against Getafe at home was last... Uh, was it last year in May 2022 where we won 1-0 and that was when Asensio scored so it's been yeah, it's been like four months since we last played against Getafe at home and here we are again tomorrow we're gonna play um I think it's gonna be a 2-1 win Real Madrid and I think the goals will come from Jose Lu and Brahim Diaz I think Brahim Diaz and Jose Lu will start now because Vini is injured, he will be out for six weeks. Oh, man, Real Madrid has, are having so many injuries. Um, for example, uh, Courtois, I think he's out for the whole season. Militao, I think he's also out for the whole season. Uh, Vini's out for six weeks. Arda Guder is injured, but I think he will come back this month. Um, Denis Ceballos is injured. I think he will come back this month as well. And Ferland Mendy is currently injured. I'm not so sure when he is coming back. But, um, but yeah, one thing, you know, for sure, we do have, you know, good backups. So, not too concerned. And I think, you know, we're going to win 2 1. Jose Lu and Brahim Diaz to get the goals. I think Bellingham is going to get an assist. I don't know. Bellingham will make his uh, Bernabal debut. Oh my god. He. He has had a flying start to, uh, you know, in Spanish football. Oh my god, what a player Bellingham is. He already is the top uh, you know, goal scorer. I don't think he'll score against Get Getafe, but I think he's he's going to get an assist. But um, if he does, yeah, that would be pretty nice as well. Um, yeah, what a player Bellingham has been. He has been our top goal scorer so far. And he's a, he, he is being a leader. That is something Real needs. And after you know Karim Benzema left, but um, yeah, I think we're gonna win two one. I think this will be you know a pretty simple home win, and um, yeah, um, reflecting from last game, we could have won like three zero to be honest if Rodrigo didn't miss the penalty, but um, still fine because at least we got the win last game. Yeah, uh, please uh, check out my other videos if you haven't done so yet. And that's about all for today. Um, this is my score prediction for the Real Madrid game. Please, guys, let me know in the comments what will be your score. Pred what do you think the score prediction will be for tomorrow's game? And um, yeah, please subscribe if you're new around here. Check out my other videos if you haven't done so yet. Recently, I did a collab with um, my best friend, and he's you know. My, and my homie, Mansoor Leo. Um, please check out his channel too if you haven't done so yet. And again, um, thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll see you in the next video. See you guys.